everyone and welcome back to Random Bites of the Sweet Life. In today's video, I'm showing you how to make chocolate chip cookie delight, which is one of my favorite desserts. For this recipe, you will need a 16 and a half ounce tube of chocolate chip cookie dough, three cups of cold milk, a 3.9 ounce package of instant chocolate pudding, a 3.4 ounce package of instant vanilla pudding, an eight ounce package of cream cheese, one cup of confectioner's sugar, and I like to use 16 ounces of Cool Whip. The recipe technically calls for 12 divided, so you would use six ounces in one par portion and the other six in the other, but I'm gonna use these to keep it much easier. These are eight ounces each, so I'll just use one for one portion of the recipe and the other for the other, and I'll show you how that goes next. The first thing you're gonna need is a 16 and a half ounce tube of cookie dough. I have a 30 ounce because that's the only one I could find. So I'm just gonna cut this pretty much in half and we're going to spread that out into this pan. You're gonna to wanna to preheat your oven to 350 degrees and then with your cookie dough, spread it out into a 13 by nine inch cooking tray. You wanna keep your tray ungreased and just press the dough into the tray until it, it's covers into all the corners and I'll show you that next. Flatten it down. And this is why you wanna make sure it's softened already so it'll be much easier to spread it out. It has to cover the entire surface of the tray. So next you wanna just place this in the oven at 350 degrees for approximately 15 minutes. Once the 15 minutes are up, you wanna take your cookie out of the oven and place it on a wire rack to cool. So we'll let that sit there for a while and we'll go on to the next step. Step, we're gonna take a mixing bowl and we're gonna take the two packages of instant pudding and we're gonna mix that in the bowl with three cups of cold milk. We'll just mix this together and slowly pour in the milk. You wanna mix this thoroughly until there are no lumps and let it sit. This will form into the pudding that you need and then I'll show you the next step. To combine the cream cheese, the confectioner's sugar, and one package of the Cool Whip. Add the cream cheese to the mixing bowl and start to whip it. You wanna combine the cream cheese and the sugar together and then also add in your Cool Whip. When you let it soften, it makes this part much easier. and then spread this cream cheese sugar mixture onto the cookie. Then you wanna get out your chocolate and vanilla pudding mixture and put that on top the cream cheese mixture. And finally, the last step is to take your other container of Cool Whip and spread that out across the top of this. Now the key to this is to make sure this is nice and smooth before you start putting it on there because it will be very hard to smooth it out if it's not already in a, in a pretty whipped consistency. So I'm just mixing it around to do that. Once the Cool Whip has softened sufficiently, go ahead and spread it on top of your pudding. Thank you. 
The last thing you'll want to do is go ahead and place this in your refrigerator for about eight hours or overnight. It's ideal to leave it in for that long. However, I don't like to wait that long. I'm going to put this in the fridge for about an hour or two and at that point it's ready enough for me. Now that our Cookie Delight has had a chance to sit in the refrigerator for a little while, we're going to cut our piece and I'm going to have a taste. Here it is. So good. Mm. And here you can see all four layers. It's so good.